Hi, this is Kit Welchlin and welcome to Welchlin.com. Today's video blog is on the art of influence. The question is, what strategies influence others? I would like to have greater impact on the organization. Last week, a coworker asked me for a copy of the mission statement. We have a mission statement? I didn't know where it was and I was afraid of what it would say. Sometimes I feel invisible. I wish I was invisible, that would be fun. Anyway, what strategies can I use to influence others? There are several strategies you can implement that influence others. Finding a copy of the mission statement or value statement would be a good start. Use facts and data to make logical and rational presentations of ideas. Solid reasoning is persuasive. Use flattery, create goodwill, act humbly, and be friendly long before you make a request. Friendliness is always appreciated and welcomed. Coordinate support for others' ideas that align with the organization's values and priorities. Be an active participant in discussions. Develop negotiation skills and express the willingness to exchange benefits or favors. Flexibility is a key component for reaching consensus or inspiring compromise. Build relationships with and gain support from people in the organization that have higher authority. Management and leadership backing can bolster influence. Be assertive in your communication style and openly discuss compliance concerns and issue reminders that keep projects on track. Stay on top of activities. Assess your position in the organization and consider what rewards and punishments are at your disposal. Be realistic about what you can promise or take away. A little can go a long way. Yeah, yeah, a little bit can go a long way. So I will do a little bit of everything you just said. Yes, facts and data would be good. I will start looking for some of that. Flattery, you look sharply dressed today. Yeah, yeah, well, I suppose we should wrap this up and get to the other things we need to do today. Thank you for watching this video blog on the art of influence. So the question was, what strategies influence others? There are many strategies we can use to influence others. Sometimes we just need a list that we can trust and the confidence to put ideas into practice. The art of influence does involve a certain amount of soft skills, and those soft skills can amount to quite a bit of influence. Check back to Welchland.com every Monday for a new video blog. Oh my, oh my, I have so many gifts to share. I can build my spheres of influence in so many places. I am highly skilled. I have ideas. I can help. I have a little circle. I will work to create big circles.